Hey guys, welcome back, or bomb here, bringing another episode of PTC Joe content. Thank you guys so much for the support. I do appreciate it. We are at 607 when I last checked, and we just recently hit 600, so that is great. Remember, uh, if you like the evolutions content, if you like my voice, if you like the way I make videos, I don't know. If you like my shit, be sure to hit the subscribe button because I greatly appreciate it. I also upload things like Let's Plays, Showdown content, soon Wi Fi, and then of course, Sun and Moon is coming, and we're all so hyped. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to drop that like already. If I know some of y'all have already hit that like. I know that you guys come here to hit that like to support your boy, and you guys are the real MVPs. And if I could figure out which one of you that did it, I would give you all a pack. I know I give a pack to one, but that's, that's beside the point. Uh, remember, if you answer whatever comment questions today is asked throughout the video, I will be giving you a pack down in the comments. But let's go on. Today, we are hitting. You guys already saw. I know why you guys. You guys saw that thumbnail. You guys saw the powerful Charizard that was on that thumbnail, didn't you? All right. You guys saw this beautiful art. Look how gorgeous this card is. I want it IRL, man. It's so pretty. Don't have it, but I want it. I pulled almost every other card from this set, except for all of the full art starters and Brock Grit. It's so irritating. But yeah, let's go into the set. We are playing with Charizards today, both X and Y. And I'm gonna go over how I built this deck. Now, Charizard's kind of difficult to build in standard. You don't have things like Blacksmith to support you. Um, this Charizard's not, I mean, this Charizard's good in some matchups because 100 damage is actually really nice. Um, but, I mean, 100 for only, for four energies is kind of bad. Um, so I decided to pair it with Talonflame. Just add a little bit more consistency to the deck. I'm gonna go over it. So I am playing four Talonflame, of course, and only three Charizards. That way we have a much higher chance of landing Talonflame as our first Pokemon. Uh, I, I chose the Flame Coke Charizard because we have such a high need for energies, and I'm not playing anything like Volcanion or uh, anything like that. Uh, Flame Cloak is really, really nice. Gives you an energy from the discard pile, plus it does 30 damage, so it's really, really good. I like it a lot. Uh, I am playing one of the Generations Charizards for specific matchups, especially things that are weak to fire, which is actually a lot of decks right now, for whatever reason. Uh, this is the only Charizard I'm going to need. Heat Typhoon does 100 damage, and then for each for each Fire Energy card I have attached to it, it uh, flip a coin. For each Heads, uh, I do 50 more damage, so that damage can rack up if I have a lot of Fire Energies. Uh, 220 HP is not too bad either. And then I do play two of the Charizard Ys. This is has this is the Crimson Dive one for three. Does 300 damage. Literally, if I'm finding big fat decks that need to die, I go with this Charizard. I do like two suicidal hits or one or two suicidal hits. Plus, that has a one retreat cost. is really nice. Uh, supported by the DCE. Only needs two fire energy, but it needs five energy altogether, which is really really difficult to do. Which is why I'm playing four Mega Turbos this time, and I'm playing Puzzle of Time to get back those Mega turbos because I have to constantly be giving this man energy non-stop. I'm playing one escape rope because escape rope is good. One super rod to put back Charizards in the deck if I have to discard them through Sycamore or something. Four trainer mails to get those uh, puzzle times and mega turbos. Uh, four ultra balls and four VS seekers, all those consistency purposes. One hex maniac, just deal with green ninja. Uh, Lysander, actually it also deals with, uh, with Giratina too. Lysander is here because Lysander stalling is always good, plus it's a good card. Uh, two ends one ranger and four sigmore i'm playing the ranger for reg ice matchups plus glacian matchups uh those are always really annoying teammates is here uh things will most likely get knocked out plus i like playing teammates when i have a puzzle time deck i might drop it we'll see three scorched earths i don't really need that many scorched earths but it's good for draw support and to put our fire energies in the discard pile which i'm playing seven of uh three charizard spear links i'd add a fourth if i could but deck space is kind of tight plus i'm running talent flame and then uh four dces that is the deck Let's get into the matches. Yeah, yeah. I love this beat so much, guys. All right, okay. Or bomb, I'm coming in the beat, and I'm gonna be the one that beats all of you people. Where's my deck? Yeah. Hit him with the charts of talent, flame, damn niggas. I'm coming at you with the crimson dive, and then I dive in them DMs so that your chick sees me. They call me Red, and I'll take your bitch that's Crystal B. <laughs> I'm so tired. I just woke up, but I'm here. Oh my god, this man just man just hit the hit the hit the done. That man just hit the quit button real quick with the swiftness. I have no idea what happened. He must have clicked the wrong deck by accident. But yep, let's I guess let's keep going. Maybe he just saw the bad matchup and was just like, nope. I honestly don't even I don't even look at this anymore. I mean, I did look at it that time because like 
you know, I was pointing at, making a point. <sighs> We're fighting Psychic Dark, so it could be Eveltal Mew, it could be Eveltal Garbodor. Eveltal Garbodor is not a big deal, just because we have uh, no abilities that we need to be worried about. Uh, Eveltal Garbodor is annoying though, because it does hit for a lot of damage if it if he sets up really well. And I like Eveltal Garbodor. I know that one. I know it won Florida Regionals, and that's a deck I want to profile on the channel and like get some matches with because it looks like a lot of fun. I might change up my dark deck, not my dark deck, but my uh, Eveltal Mew deck to be that because I don't like Eveltal Mew. It's interesting, but like I don't know, it's weird. Just because the influx of Garbodor and its ability to be super annoying. But this man, Demon's Chaser, is just taking years. So the first guy just quit with the swiftness, and this guy's just like, I don't wanna pick I don't wanna pick a coin. Unless that's me losing internet like I always do. That could be irritating. Man, I did a real quick profile too, and now these people are taking 30 years to pick a thing. No, it's not me losing internet, although I would have been I wouldn't be surprised if it was. Oh there it is, so it's my turn. This man is not even here. Is he even here? I don't think he's here. Yeah, I don't think this man's here. I don't care enough. Yeah, I don't care enough. I just want to go. Because I want I want to record a video. I'm not going to sit here and like play out a game when I have a limited amount of time. <laughs> I'd rather get a video and it's already been six. I had a real quick deck profile. I was kind of proud of that one, guys. Yeah, I was kind of proud. I was kind of proud. I was kind of proud. We are fighting. Oh, are we fighting my baby girl? Don't make me fight my baby girl. You can't make me fight my favorite deck. You can't do this to me. Don't do this to me. This deck is too good. You can't do this. Can I? Oh, I got a. Wow. Okay, this is a good sign for like a good day because I never get a talent flame started. Hold on. Hold on. Am I going first too? I don't. I don't even see. I hope I'm going first. Oh my god, my baby girl, no! I'm gonna be sad, guys. So, let's take a look at this right here. 220 HP, if I do 50 damage to myself, I am left with 170. 170 is kind of difficult for Gardevoir to hit 170. So, what I think I can do is I can get one, one attack off, two attacks off most likely while being suicidal, and I'm going second. Second's not too bad, actually. Um... At least now I can get. What can I get with the set went by going second? I can get a spirit link. I can get a spirit link, and I guess like some sort of draw support. It all depends on what I need. But I definitely need to attach this fire energy. What I can do actually is I can grab a fire energy. Oh, so there's this, there's my draw support. So I can grab a fire energy. I won't be enough though, unfortunately. So here's what I'll do. I don't need to play my Ultra Ball right now. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna play Arrow Blitz. <clears throat> I'm gonna grab a Spirit Link. I have all my char Dude, this is this is this is amazing. The one time I've, I fight like a really hard opponent to beat, but like I get an amazing, amazing start. I'll get a Spirit Link and I'll get a Fire Energy. Uh, the reason why I'm getting the Fire Energy is I can Ultra Ball discard it to get another Charizard on the field, and then I can Mega Turbo back on. I have my DCE, so I have three energies attached already. Now all I have to do is hit him, is let him not knock me out, even though he's most definitely going to knock me out. But if he knocks me out, that's two energies. Uh, it's not enough, unless I make it Charizard X, but Charizard X is not going to kill Gardevoir. Unless I get lucky. I have to get lucky to kill Gardevoir. This is going to be... He's playing Xerneas, too, which is also weird. I don't really agree with playing Xerneas. Because, like, if you're attacking with Xerneas, you're really slowing yourself down. He plays the Fairy Garden... I can see it. Life. Oh, he doesn't even. Oh my God. He's giving us time. He's giving us time. This man is. This man is so nice. He's so nice. He's nice with it. He's nice with it. Let me do this. Let me do this. Let me. Oh, wait. what do I get off this trainer man? Let's find out. Let's get. Ooh, Scorch Earth is perfect. Now I don't have to Ultra Ball. At least not yet. Let's get some good draw support. I don't want him to retreat. Let me uh, do this. Another DCE. That doesn't help me though. Not yet, at least. Let me play the Mega Turbo. What I can do is I can get another Charizard down. Let me do that. Let me get another Charizard down. Charizard. So all I need now is a Fire Energy. 
to discard a spear link, I guess, for Charizard. I can attach a DCE to it. Well, I want two fire energies, don't I? One to discard and one to attach. I think I think that's what I want. Uh, Mega Turbo doesn't help me. Yeah, let's go ahead and just get two fire energies. One to attach, one for discard for draw for a Mega Turbo, and that should be... That's five energies, yep. Two fire energies are coming my way. Well, he's all about my way. I, I'm running it low on energies, though. That's one. Oh, I don't, there's two energies prize. That could be a problem. But as long as everything works out here, I should be set. I get free retreat. So if he doesn't knock me out, that would be spectacular. Although he's putting my fire energies away. How dare you? Hope that I can draw both of them. That would be spectacular. Uh, I drew none of them. Although I did get a VS Seeker, I don't, VS Seeker doesn't really help me. I don't want to stick away his hand away, but I think I might have to. Life Leap. Nah, maybe not. I could Hex. I don't know if that helps me. Let's play this. See what I grab. Ultra Ball doesn't give me much. Super Red doesn't give me much. I need this puzzle. I don't need anything from those things. I'll just click done there. If I were to Sycamore, I'm losing two VS Seekers and a Mega Turbo. Although I feel like attaching an energy this turn is more important because I have to be fast and aggressive. All I need is three knockouts after all. So there's one energy. Ooh, there's a Mega too. Ch X or Y, X or Y. I feel like X is better. Uh, well, X can get me knockouts on Shamans if he doesn't get rid of them. Now, I know there's two more Mega Turbos in the deck, and I have a chance of getting some back with, with Puzzle. So let me do this. There's another Spear Link. So I can actually have all three Charizards down at some point. Uh, let me go ahead. Let me Gale Wings. Let me grab another Puzzle of Time. And a Fire Energy. One Puzzle is prized also. So far we have a Puzzle prized. We have two Fire Energies prized. Can he keep up ending? He can Mega Evolve now, can he? I mean, the second he knocks me out, the better he'll be. That's why I don't, I want to like put my Talonflame in the, in the bench like right away. But I don't think I'm going to have that kind of luxury. This man's playing both Xerneas and Max Elixir in a Mega Guard of War the build. That's interesting. Can you Mega? Is he going to Mega? Does he have the uh, Retreat cost or the Stadium? Oh no, don't end. Why would you? Do you have to retreat, dude? <laughs> what does ending do? I guess he does want to get a stadium. Never mind. That makes sense. It's just me being crazy. Give me my stuff, though. Sorry, guys. I'm moving my thing around. Um, there's a puzzle. Uh, a mega turbo would be spectacular. I might have to sycamore. Did he get his thing? Here's another mega. Oh, he, he plays that. Okay, that makes sense. So this deck list makes a lot more sense now that he's. Uh, now that I know he's playing this Mega Guard too. He has a Spear Link on both of them. Interesting. There's his Mega Turbo. Alright, cool. That makes sense though. This is going to be annoying. Because that one actually can hit for hard. If I'm not careful. Uh, if I can just attack with Charizard this turn. No. That's unfortunate. He's waiting for a Stadium. All I have to do is attack with Charizard this turn and I'm set. That's literally all I have to do. You think I can Sycamore? I don't want to lose this puzzle time though. I might Lysander stall out the Hoopa. Then again, all he needs is a. Is, actually, he doesn't need because he needs a two. It does a two retreat cost. I'm gonna do that. Let me let me just do that real quick. I do want to get rid of my hand, but I also really want to. I'm gonna get a puzzle of time. And do I get a fire energy? I mean, I have a DC in my hand right now. What else could I get if I could get something? Puzzle of time. And let's grab... I don't want to grab a fire energy, but I might have to. And I definitely want to get rid of my cards in my hand. Let me grab Ultra Ball. Just in case I don't, Lys I don't Sycamore next turn and I have to like Lysander or something, I can at least get rid of my Talent Flames. Grab the other Charizard. So the oh perfect. So with these two puzzles, I can 
put my final energy on Mega Charizard. I can attach a DCE to this Charizard. I can get two Mega Turbos back. I think I'll have to get two Mega Turbos back because I don't want to uh, be stuck. And then I can Ultra Ball to grab my other Charizard Y. And then I can start setting up this Charizard Y because if this one gets knocked out or if I have to retreat it or something, I can attach two here with, uh, or I can attach another one with the other Mega Turbo. And the whole reason why I have the Puzzle Times in my deck is for Mega Turbo. So I get one big knockout soon. He got his Fairy Garden, but does he have an energy to attach? That's what he needs. What, what is he grabbing? Is he grabbing another Mega so that he can just make evolve and end his turn? Oh, I guess he is. All right, Mega and end. Mega and end. Do it. I dare you. I dare you. Yes. Perfect. So now I can Lysander and knock out this one. Let me attach here. Let me double puzzle. Let me grab two Mega Turbos. I just feel like that's my best play. As much as I hate doing this, I just feel like it's my best play. Let me Ultra Ball. Get rid of these Talon Flames in case he continues to end me. Uh, let me grab this Charizard. And now I can keep this Talon Flame in the back to prepare for, prepare for more. So there we go. And now that one's ready. So now I can get a big knockout here. I'm gonna knock out the one that's not ready yet. So then, oh no, what? You can't be serious right now. I just ha <laughs> I hate my life. I literally misclicked. I'm gonna lose this game now. I'm so I was so excited to win this game. Cause all I had to do was Lysander that out, get a knockout. But I guess it's smarter if I get some draw support going. That's unfortunate. Oh well. I'm being an escape rope or some bull crap like that. I just don't want to lose to this thing. I only have one VS Seeker left in the deck. Oh, well, I got two Mega Turbos off this, so I guess it's not the end of the world. Uh, there's no need for me to super out right now. I'm so I'm so upset though. I'm so upset. Um, where's my escape rope? Do I, I still have it in the deck? I know I saw it. Uh, I'm gonna play. This is my last puzzle, anyways. There it is. I need a VS Seeker, but that's not gonna happen. Um, that's really, really, really upsetting. That's really upsetting though. Uh, that's so upsetting. I'm so upset. That was so infuriating. I definitely meant to click on that. You guys are... Uh, mm, I was gonna Lysander out the stupid Skyla. Oh god, don't do this to me. It's infuriating, man. I have to play end this turn. I can't even do anything. What do I have? Escape rope. Here's what I can do at the very least. I can bait out something. Let me escape rope. I'll just play end the following turn. Because what I can do is I'm just going to go into town flame. I'll just keep setting up. It's whatever. I made a huge mistake, that's my bad. I 100%, I 100% agree with the big mistake I made. I'm gonna grab my final Lysander. Cause I have to do this whole process all over again. That was so infuriating. Yeah, this is all I want. Do I need a DC? I'm gonna take the fire energy because I can attach it, but I'm running, I'm running super low on cards, so I'm not gonna do this anymore. I can always super rod things back, but there's nothing to super rod back right now except for Talon Flames, and now I'm not that I'm not I'm not that desperate. Here comes the Lysander. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That is a definite knockout, and it's super, super, super annoying. It's so annoying. It's so I was going to kill that thing. It's so irritating. Whatever. I get I get a Charizard ready right here. I have my three mega turbos and the energy to attach. So screw this guy. Now I don't have to worry about Lysandering it. I can always, uh, was it Super Rod? Or, or, do I have the all three Spirit Links used up? I do, so there's no point. I'm just gonna attack with these remaining ones. I don't have to play that right now. I can play N, but then I'll be like, literally, I will literally lose. So let's Crimson Dive. Get my 
a knockout. Can he set up another one in time? Because I'm gonna Lysander out another one of these, and then I'm gonna knock out the final card with this Charizard if I can get the energies attached for it. But this man needs two energies on this Gardevoir. Does he play energy switch? Man, I would have won this game. That would that was that was I would the prize exchange would be in my favor. Oh god, don't have an energy attachment, dude. Don't be that guy. This man is gonna play off my mistake. I don't blame him too, because that was that was all my fault. That was so infuriating. Uh, I'm so angry. Whatever, I gotta get over it. Don't have another Mega Turbo. Don't do it. Don't be that lucky. Don't luck out of this game. Good. Good. Oh my god. Don't luck out of this game. Don't get another Mega Turbo. Damn it! I can't, man. I just can't. I'm too angry. That was so infuriating. I won this game. I can't do anything either. Like, I don't... I have one DCE, but there's no... I can get fire energies with Super Rod, I suppose. I'll have to end them down to two. He doesn't have another Gardevoir out, so I'm gonna do this. Let me play Super Rod. Let me play this so he can't retreat anything. I'm gonna have to play N and hope for the best. Let me put my fire energies back. I have to get one DCE. So I'm gonna have to N and like I'm gonna have to hope that I can get the DCE that I need. Oh, I can play teammates. <laughs> but then like he's I can't I can't play I can't afford to play teammates. I don't have Ultra Ball. I can't afford to play teammates because I need to end him down to two so he can't Lysander me out and win. Yeah, I have to play N. N is the highest chance I have of winning this game. I really, uh, would you result? yes, I really need to get a DC off this. I'm pretty positive there's one more left. Oh, I didn't get it. Yeah, there is one more left. I, I'm pretty sure I saw it. So all I have to do is get the DCE, and then I have to hope for some good coin flips. That's my way of winning. So let's see. All right, there's the DCE. There's my fire energy. I'm going to grab that just in case. I have Lysander in play, so I'm not worried about that. I have to get really good coin flips to win this game. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's not going to be enough. All right. I need some really good coin flips. Come on, coin gods. Avenge me for my misclick. Avenge me. Teammates doesn't do much for me. So I'm not going to bother. I can end him down to one. Let's end you down to one. The less cards you get, the better. I have to win this game through this. I got Lysander too. Oh my god. It all it all depends on this. Charizard, you need to get one head. 50% chance. Or oh, actually, there we go. There we go, Charizard. Alright, that's one down. All I have to do is kill the Shaman and I win. All I gotta do is beat the Shaman down. All I gotta do is beat down the Shaman. Literally all I have to do is beat down the Shaman. Actually. Since I have to get one head streak. Oh, wait a minute. No. He's already damaged on the Shaman. I win. That's it. GG. Yes. Oh, that was the comeback. The comeback is real. The comeback is real. Give me this Shaman. I didn't realize it was already damaged. Get out of here. Eat this heat type. Just get... Yeah, that's what I thought. Ah. Charizard coming through. Oh, man. That was stupid. I'm so dumb. I'm so bad at Pokemon, guys. I don't know why you guys are even subscribed to me, to be honest. <laughs> Your boy misclicks and almost cost the whole game. Ha, <sighs> all right. Okay, okay, okay. Fire Psychic, is this? Well, it's not, it's not Volcanion because there's no water. What's Fire Psychic? It's not Typhlosion because Typhlosion doesn't run Psychic. What could be Fire Psychic? Unless I'm also playing a Charizard deck. Charizard Hoopa, that could be a thing. Oh, I didn't start with Town Flame. No, I needed my. T I need Town Flame starts, so that's actually really annoying. So now I have four Town Flames chilling somewhere. I can't do anything. 
Uh, this might be Typhlosion. Is he attacking with Mew also? Because that's a horrible idea. It's Typh... Alright, I mean, I'm gonna probably gonna lose because Typhlosion sets up quickly. But, like, that's kind of weird. I didn't even get a Talon Flame Star. That's the most annoying part about it. Let's see. I can hopefully get some Mega Turbos. I can Ultra Ball away my fire energy maybe i'll get this maybe i'll get the stadium before he does do i even want to put down the stadium though because i can help him big time help him draw through his deck because that's all that type of needs to do is draw through his deck to get all of his uh components to win the game then again that's like every deck in pokemon that's pokemon literally in a nutshell Anyways, this man needs to make a play. Come on. Don't do this to me, dude. There we go. Thank you. Let's go. Would you like to draw a card? Yes. Yes. All right. Mega Turbo. Uh, he does play Mew. That's so weird. Okay. I can Ultra Ball the Fire Energy and the Talon Flame to get... Charizard. He can't evolve next turn. So I can get Charizard Y. I doubt this man plays N. I'm gonna get Charizard. Should I get Y or X? Because I'm pretty sure they have 150 HP. And X seems safer because it has less energies to attack. So I'm gonna try getting X. I think they'll have to be my play. But because I'm most likely going to end this turn, because I have to get an energy attachment this turn, I'm probably going. To, I'm just I have to grab the Charizard. I can't grab Charizard Y or X or anything like that. I have to grab this. I hate that I'm gonna end because I literally set myself up to not do it, but I need to get an energy. Uh Sycamore. Do I want a Sycamore instead? Not really. Maybe I do though, because he seemed kinda stuck. He didn't put down Cyndaquil or anything. Then again, he could probably just play Skylar or something. I don't know. Because I'm losing a Mega Turbo. And that, I guess it doesn't matter. I might as well. Like, whatever keeps me the most consistent. I have to get a DC this turn anyways. Consistency is key to Pokemon. There's my DC. All right. So that ended up working out for me. I also got another Ultra Ball for the following turn. Um, and I can Sycamore again next turn, too. So, yeah, I can just end my turn. There you go. That actually worked out pretty nicely for me. Because what I can do next turn is I can Ultra Ball to get my Charizard uh, X. I'm going to try X. I don't know if X is my best play. Um... But I'm going to give it a shot anyways, because it takes less to attack. And whichever one takes less to attack, I, I, I have a higher chance of knocking things out, essentially. What is he going to do? Flame Cloak? <laughs> That's kind of funny if he does. But yeah, I can Ultra Ball away my Talon Flame. Actually, it doesn't matter what I Ultra Ball away. But yeah, he just Flame Cloaks. Alright, so that might be GG if everything works out. So let me go ahead and grab X. I have to get an Energy and I have to get a Mega Turbo. Yeah, I have to get an energy and a mega turbo. I won't be able to attack with Y this turn at all. Unless I get a stadium discard, two mega turbos, and an energy attachment. Which is a lot to ask for, I'm not gonna lie. So let me go ahead and play Sycamore again. That's two VS Seekers down. If I don't win this turn, I'm just gonna be kind of annoying. Um, but if I don't win this turn, I could probably attack with this Charizard in the back. Three puzzles, no fire energies. But three puzzles, will that help me at all? It will not. Oh, I can't attack this turn. I have to play. Uh, am I gonna have to play Sycamore next turn? That's so frustrating, yo. Let me attach this here. Let me end my turn. I didn't get a single fire. How? <sighs> Whatever. I'll grab Sycamore next turn. I literally just have to run through the deck and hope for the best. This man is stuck with his fire energies. I guess he's trying to go for Heat Typhoon. Heat Typhoon might win him the game, to be honest. There's my fire energy. Now what? Do I have a fire? I don't. I do have a fire energy down here. Okay, let me grab Mega Turbo and um, put two cards in my hand. Let me grab Mega Turbo and Sycamore. Mega Turbo, Sycamore. Let's do this. 
Mega Turbo here. All right, in case I lose, let me play Sycamore so I can get a Charizard Y in play. More Fire Energy uh, and more Mega Turbos. Actually, not bad. Um, this is not a bad hand whatsoever. As I can attach, I can Mega Turbo if anything ha wrong happens to my Mega Charizard. I just have to set myself up. Grab another Sycamore. That won't help me too much, but at least I'll have it. All right, Charizard, can you just win me the game right now? That would be greatly appreciated. Heads, there it is. All right, perfect. So that's GG there. Um, setup was a lot faster than what I was expecting. And my phone went buzz buzz and it's all the way over there. It looks like a text message. Or it could be Twitter, one or the other. Anyways, it's been 30 minutes and I'm going to play one more game because as of late, I've been giving you guys short videos and this is my Charizard video. All right, this needs to be the most exciting video I have. All right, guys, we're back. Check it, man. I've been trying to get a good battle for you guys for the past 30 minutes. I battled some really crappy matchups for my opponents. I ended up winning like turn one, turn two, um, just because they end up forfeiting and stuff like that. And then whenever I find a good game, it's against the same exact decks. So, like I played that, I played that Typhlosion deck like three times now. The Typhlosion Mew guy. Nobody's playing right now. Y'all people need to get up on like you guys need to get up at like 9 a.m. CST. Hop on that versus ladder, whatever I record. That's what y'all gotta do. Specifically on Monday, Thursdays, and occasionally Fridays. I lost a coin flip. Come on! Oh, excuse me, that was a nasty hiccup. Not by nasty, I mean like it was loud. Okay, look, look, and then this happens. Everybody I've been playing today has been moving at like mock speeds of snail. I don't know. <laughs> It was moving too slow. That's what I'm trying to say. Like I'm trying to, I'm out here trying to get a video done for the viewers, because I know the viewers want to see this video. I know they want to see me my rendition of Charizard. They're out there like, man, I can't wait for Aura to upload his Mega Charizard deck. I bet it's gonna be spectacular because that's all he uploads is spectacular nonsense. I'm just like, oh, I, pre I, I appreciate it. I really do. All right, can you like make it? Oh, this man's also playing Charizard. He's playing Psychic. Ooh, I have a talent fit. Oh my god, look at that butt. It's looking so nice. Nigga, what's up? Alright, so here's what I'm gonna do. I have Charizard down. I'm going second. Which is annoying because I can't attach a DCE like I would prefer to. He point has no basics, like done. Okay. He's going first. So here's what I wanna do. I want to use Talon Flame. Since I'm going second to attack to get a spirit link and a mega turbo. Then I want to attach a DCE to my Charizard next turn, use a mega turbo after I ultra ball the crap to grab the Charizard Y. But this can all change based on what I get from Trainer Mail. But from this and my draw, but from my first hand right now, that's what I want. Because then I could attack with a Charizard Y probably faster than he can. Although he is probably playing Volcanion, and unless he's uh, if he's figured out a way to make it better than me, then that's great. This man is taking years. Come on, come on. All right, you know what? I'm gonna give him a smiley face and tell him to hurry up. All right, maybe that might work because this man is actually taking years. Is he here? Cause like I fought I fought a person that wasn't even here last time. Okay, he's here. So this man needs to hurry up, dude. Oh, he's playing Skyfield, so he's not playing Charizard, he's just playing Volcanion. Oh, that's why it's Fire Water. Hello? I'm gonna lose then, because Volcanion's actually a horrible matchup for me. Plus, he can, like, get up some mad damage because of Steam Up. He has a VS Secret in hand. He dropped his, uh, he dropped his, uh, Sycamore. So he's in a Hoopa, he's gonna get all his Volcanions, and he's in a Sycamore. Three Volcanions is actually a problem for me. We'll see. We will see. We will see. You know what, for all of you guys that have made it this far in the video, I'm going to give out a code live, alright? I want you guys to pay attention very closely, and if you get the code, let me know in the comments down below, hey, I got the code, alright? And then if you want to tell me what you got, that'd be cool too, but let me know, alright? So here's the code, alright, check it, TJ9PCBMLPX. V nine L. Alright, that is an evolutions pack. Alright? You guys can rewind that shit if you want to hear it again. I am currently ripping it. 
You guys heard that? I know you guys heard it. So now nobody else can use it. All right. So you guys get it it's for the viewers out there. I should probably save that code for like a week from now <laughs> in case nobody gets it. But it's too late. If nobody gets that pack, uh, then it's forever lost in the abyss. All right, this man is all oh, look at look at that beautiful setup. This man is doing it right now. So Charizard Y is gonna help in this matchup a lot because Charizard Y actually Oko's everything. Although I can't let his I can't allow him to let his Volcanions to attack. Uh, he hasn't end me either. He played Sycamore. So if everything goes really well and he doesn't end me next turn either, then we are set, my boys. Also, there's a couple of decks I want to play like after Evolution's hype kind of dwindles down. Um, I want to play updated updated Greninja. Updated Volcanion. I want to play. That's really it, though. Updated Greninja, updated Volcanion. There's not a lot of other decks that get updated thanks to this new set. Oh, of course, my girl Giratina. All right. I mean, there's Rayquaza too, but I don't really like playing Rayquaza. Like, I can play Rayquaza on the channel because it's good. I have all the cards for it. It's just not my favorite deck. It's so boring to play. It's so boring. That's the thing about Rayquaza, man. There's a lot of that's that's the thing about a lot of decks that I played before. Like, like they're good and stuff, but they're boring. Like. Like a lot of good decks are just like straightforward and annoying, like Mega Mewtwo deck. Mega Mewtwo decks. I don't play Mega Mewtwo because it's actually boring. Like there's nothing exciting about playing Mega Mewtwo. Um, I don't play. I never play Night March because once again, there's nothing exciting about playing Night March. Uh, the only deck that is like really good that I do have, have a lot of excitement playing is Greninja. Because Greninja is actually so much fun. I don't know what it is. Like Water Shuriken plus Water Duplicates makes you feel empowered during the game. Maybe it's a sense of control. I like control when it comes to my games. Although I don't like item lock. I hate item lock. Item lock is dull too, man. Dark Tina is like kind of fun. Because just because Max Elixir is fun. Because Max Elixir feels risky while you're playing it. This man is taking like 30 years. What's your favorite deck archetype? Like what's your favorite deck right now? Like, and not because it's good, but like what's your favorite deck to play because it's a lot of fun? Why? You, what else do you have? Why are you steaming up? You're not attacking me this turn. I guess you're just putting it in the discard pile. Okay, I can get if you're putting it in the discard pile. That's fine. Put it in the discard pile, so just in case I end you, that you don't have to worry about them not being in your discard pile. I get it. I really do. Look at all these things in my hand. All right, let me see. Can I get a Spirit Link off this? I can get a Scorched Earth. I will take a Scorched Earth. All right, so check it. I can get one single Mega Turbo now. You play the Scorched Earth. It's going to help him too, but... The very least is like, I don't know, lets me do this. <laughs> uh, no spirit link, I don't want to end at all. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna arrow blitz. I grab my mega turbo and my spirit link. Like I originally planned. And hopefully I top deck something that's like a supporter. Spirit link, there's, all, there's one spirit link prize and mega turbo, perfect. All right, big dog. You need to do 130 damage to knock me out. 30, 60, 90, 120. I don't think there's a way you can knock me out unless you have all four, three, you have to have 30, 60, 90. No, you have to have all four Volcanions down, I believe. Then you can hit one, and you have to have a Fighting Fury belt. And then I think you hit 150. Because you're doing 30 naturally if you have a Fighting Fury belt. And then you're doing 120 more thanks to all four Volcanions, which is 150. Now, if you have one less Volcanion than that, you're only hitting 120. So, there's no way that he can knock out my Talonflame this turn, which gives me a whole extra turn to set up. And while I'm attacking with Charizard X in the back, uh, Charizard Y in the back, I can set up, I can set up another Charizard, hopefully. It all depends on my draws. Uh, but yeah, that's going to be the plan, because here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to attach, I'm going to Mega, I'm going to attach a DCE, I'm going to Mega Turbo. That's three energies right there, and then I'm going to, yeah, after Ultra Balls. And then I can have, a, I'll have a VS Seeker in the back. I might have to drop a Double Colorless, which is something I don't want to do. He's also setting up a Flareon, which I think is a horrible idea. I got two Mega Turbos, that's spectacular. Let me attach this here. It doesn't help me, though. Let me attach this here. At all, actually. So I think I have to drop one. I am gonna have to drop one. Let me grab Charizard Y. So I have all my Charizards. I don't know what's prize then. Probably just supporters. 
which is actually perfect. Mega Turbo. All right, so here's what I'm gonna do now. I'm going to play end the following turn most likely. So what I need is an energy and a mega turbo. Because with an energy, a mega turbo, I can discard to draw more. And that might lead me to another energy, I think. Maybe. Is that my best? I don't know. I mean, let me attack for now. Let me figure it out. I mean, he's going to knock me out this turn. That's for sure. So let's, let's figure this out. An energy in a mega turbo means that I have an attachment no matter what because of drawing and whatnot. At the very least. I only have one more spirit link left in the deck, so I have to be very careful about that. And I have N in the back, so when he knocks me out, he's taking he's only gonna have five cards in his hand. So that's another reason why I want to play the N over a Sycamore. Although, yeah, I'm definitely gonna do that. Look, he has a Flareon ready already. That's wild. That's wild. Which is actually really bad for me because I can't let him set up this thing. Even though, oh man, if I can streamline Hex, that'd be nice too. Let's see, there's a flow, so that's bad. Is he gonna Lysander? Don't Lysander. Don't Lysander. Damn it! Can he knock me out? He can, I think. 30, 60. 60 plus the 110. He's not knocking me out, but it's really infuriating. I'm not gonna lie. I have to set up, but I have another Town Flame in the back ready to set up. Oh, wait a minute. Now is he knocking me out? Because he's doing 120, right? Because he's doing 20, 40, 60, 80 more damage, which is 130. 130 plus 30, 60. 100, that's 190. He doesn't knock me out unless he gets another. Oh, no. Can he get all three energies, though? Oh, uh, no. Nah. Oh, he didn't get it. All right, I'm okay with this. That means he can't do it. I think they're both prized as a shaman. Unless he just wanted to do the shaman. Why? He should have got Volcanion and like a way to get like all of his energies back in his hand. That probably would have been the winning play for him. Fighting Fury Belt. He's still not going to be able to knock me out, though. And then his his water types are not being set up in the back, which is, which is the real fear. Yeah. I'll, at least I'll live, and I can most likely attack this turn. Ooh, I got a Charizard down too. Um, let me do this. Use an energy. I'll do that. Uh, Alright, this, this works out. Because then I can attack this turn, knock out this big threat. And in turn, knock myself out. Which is unfortunate, I will definitely agree with you there. But, by doing so... Set up another Charizard. Whatever. No, that's not whatever. Because he can just knock me out with this card. And then we both like we're in he's gonna he's gonna be winning, essentially. No. Nah. I have to attach my DC next turn just so I have some sort of like advantage. So that's a double knockout. Can I get a spirit link, please? All right, I can take a sycamore because if he like if he like draws himself down, so here's the thing: I don't want to lose my talent flame. Charizard with a DCE. If I already get uh, teammates this upcoming turn, I don't know if teammates teammates won't help me. If I can get a double puzzle, all right. Spirit Link also. I don't know. There's there's ways. There's very small ways, but they, they exist. I don't want to lose Talent Flame though, because Talent Flame is my way of like setting up everything. And although this is probably not the best play, it's the more fun play for me. And that's what I care about. It's not like I'm this this deck isn't competitive. Charizard's not competitive. At least not in standard. It's probably very competitive expanded because you have cards like Blacksmith to help you out, Fiery Torch. Uh <sighs> things like that. You have a lot more support in expanded. Plus you can play things like Jirachi to get your to get your blacksmiths. Puzzle is probably even easier to get and expanded too. You have tool droppers. Um You're playing N. Oh that sucks. Uh the whole reason why I didn't play N was so I can attach my DCE. Oof, that could be that's this is gonna be rough. Okay, this is not the worst. So I can sycamore. 
So once again, two puzzles. Actually, the, the getting this Charizard Y is decent because with Charizard, Charizard Y is a one retreat cost. So if I'm if I'm in a position where I have to retreat, that's actually kind of nice. We well, did 20 damage too. All right, so this works out. This is not the worst. Although he is setting up his uh, his Volcanions, which I am not a fan of, at, not in the slightest. Uh, all right, so we have a one attachment. Do I want to attach it? I do, because I have energies in the back. Although, I don't think there's a way I can attack this turn. And if there is, it's incredibly slim, and I don't think, I don't think it's worth it. So let me go ahead and sickle one, because I'd rather retreat and go into Town Flame, to be completely honest. There's a single puzzle. Let me Ultra Ball, let me grab another Charizard, at least get these out, out of the way. This is a long video. <laughs> if I train a male and I had a puzzle here. Alright, I didn't. I got a Mega Turbo though. I'll take the Mega Turbo. With the Mega Turbo, I can do this. I can get two puzzles with my Talent Flame right now. So let me go ahead and retreat. Actually, let me get a puzzle and a DCE. That could help a lot. Arrow Blitz. Let's see. Puzzle and a DCE. I know I have plenty in the deck. Yep. All right. Puzzle DCE means I get a Mega Turbo and I can... Uh, I get two Mega Turbos and I can attack next turn. And then I can Lysander out the setup Volcanion. And then I have to set up the other Charizard in the back and hope for some heads. <laughs> Don't end me, dude. Please don't end me. If you don't end me, I'm like set to win. More, I'm, well, at least I'm in a better position. All right, he's sick of ward. Okay, 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 okay. So check it, check it. DCE attachment, double puzzle, two mega turbos. The life center out this, that's a knockout. Oh my god, Ermac Gear. And now all I have to do is get another VS Seeker so I can life center out the, uh, the, um, the shaman and knock it out with my Charizard X if I get so lucky. <laughs> Um, I have to get Charizard X though, and okay, so there's two more VS Seekers in the deck. And I can maybe get a Spirit Link off this knockout too. Alright, that was a good plan on his part. Power Heater does- Oh, it doesn't even knock me out! Yo! It's time! It's time! It's time! No, that's- that's mine. That's- that's delicious. That's gonna be so tasty when I'm through with you. Double puzzle. Give this to me. Give this to me. This is so good. Oh man, for all of you all that stayed behind, let me know. You let me know because you guys are the real MVPs. I believe there's there better be two fire energies. Yes, there is. All right. <laughs> let me know. Hashtag Charizard comes through. <laughs> well, that depends. I have to win the game first. Don't do that yet. But <laughs> just know that I'm gonna be hella stuck right after this. <laughs> but it's so worth. It's. It's so worth. I don't have a life standard to discard pile. No! No! Wait a minute, I have an escape rope. I already retreated though, didn't I? Shit. Um, I'm gonna have to stick more. I have to stick more. I have to get a life standard. Did I retreat? I did retreat, damn it. Let me escape rope. I thought I had a, I was so sure I had a Lysander. You guys were probably all yelling at me, like he doesn't even have a Lysander. Nah, 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 nah. Okay, give me a Pokemon. I guess you can just go into Hoopa and continue to set up. Yeah, that's what I thought you'd do. Please don't have Lysander in your, or like VS Seeker. Have you, has he played Lysander? How many VS Seekers? He's played two VS Seekers and a Lysander already. Um. This is a really bad hand, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, I can get something, I guess. Let me start setting up this other Charizard. I don't need that. I need some DCEs and fire energies. DCE and... It's tough. DCE and a fire, I guess. But if he knocks me out, teammates would be kind of nice. But I, I, there's no, there's nothing to get with teammates. Never mind. DC and a fire. That's unfortunate, man. I was so sure I had the Lysander. I don't even have Lysander. Was there Lysander in the deck even? I think both of them are prized, which is gonna be really bad. 
Oh, he's gonna don't lie, saying don't, 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 please, please, don't, please, 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 please. I'm asking so nicely, dude. Please, don't do this to me. Don't. I'm so mad. I thought for sure I had a Lysan in this card pile. Oh no. Oh, 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 oh no. Oh, oh no. No, don't. My man, my man, dude. My man, my man, my man, my man, my man. My man. Don't, don't do this to me, dude. Don't have it. Don't have it. You wouldn't have done that unless you had it. Don't have it. You can knock out my thing right afterwards. You can you can have that. No! No! Ah! Uh, ah, uh, man. That sucks. That sucks. That sucks. That sucks. That sucks. I hate this guy. All right, let me try to set up a charge right in the back. I, I, I lose now. Like, 100% I lose. Like, because he has another setup Volcanion in the back. Oh, well. That was fun, guys. <laughs> Man, I would have had that, too, if I had that... Hold up, hold up. Let me double check. Let me double check. I'm, I mean, I'm going to forfeit anyways. But I want to see if I had Lysander in the deck. Because I didn't even... Do I have Lysander? I, I have them both in... The, I just never got them. All right, well, that's just unlucky. Fuck it. All right, well, that's the game, guys. <laughs> There's no way I can win that game, because even though I set up another Charizard... Uh, and knock out one of his Volcanions. He just comes in with his other Volcanion and hits me for weakness, So and then he knocks me out. So that's the game. Uh, that's Charizard for you. Charizard does essentially lose to water. There's not really anything you can do about it. And especially since Volcanion is so big and so good, Charizard is not competitive with Standard right now. It's just all there. That's all there really is to it. Um, <laughs> the setup is too difficult. But that's it. That's that's the deck. I really like it. It's a lot of fun. It's uh, If you guys want to play a fun Charizard list, um, I would definitely play that because it's, it's it's more consistent than all the other Charizard lists out there. And yeah, that's going to be the deck. So thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to drop a like, subscribe, share if you haven't already. All that good jazz. Uh, let me know what decks you want me to play next time. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace.